one of the things we've learned about Roberto Roman today is the fact that he had been deported and re-entered the country illegally. Sarah Dolloff joins us with that story. Sarah? Well, Bruce and Carol, Carol Roman has a criminal history for several felony drug convictions, and today we're learning more about his immigration record. According to Immigration and Customs Enforcement, he came to the U.S. legally in 1990. Well, following his criminal convictions, he was deported in 1998. Since then, he's been arrested twice for re-entry in the country illegally and federally prosecuted for that once. Still, he didn't appear to be hiding too carefully. A simple MySpace search netted his page with numerous photos posted of him holding guns and his hometown listed as Delta, Utah. People are fed up, and, and I am too, and I, there's no excuse for this. This person should never have been here, and um, our federal government has got to step up and do its job. We did attempt to interview ICE, about, ICE agents about this case. They said it was not their place to comment. That's also what the U.S. Attorney's Office here in Utah says as well. They did say they have about 10 to 15 cases a week involving aggravated reentry charges, meaning someone convicted of a felony and deported has been caught once again living in the U.S. Now, coming up at 6, you'll hear from an immigration attorney about the danger of those who do come back. We'll have that new, as I said, tonight at 6.